In the quietude of the great deserts and amidst the colossal pyramids of ancient Egypt, the owl, in its silent nocturnal majesty, emerged not merely as a creature of the night but as an emblem imbricated deeply within the complex tapestry of religious and cultural symbolism. M, or the owl in the hieroglyphic script, extends its wings beyond simple alphabetical representation, permeating through the spiritual and royal spheres of ancient Egyptian society. The owl, often depicted sitting attentively with keen, luminous eyes, encompasses not only a symbol of protection and vigilant wisdom but also transcends into the realms of the metaphysical, embodying an eternal understanding and bridging between the seen and the unseen, the living and the deceased. The inherent paradox of the owl a bird that can see in darkness made it an apt symbol for wisdom and intuition, bringing light to the obscurities of life and the afterlife. Delving into the core of this profound symbol, let us traverse the landscape of ancient Egypt, where pharaohs, esteemed as incarnations of divinity, were often entwined with the owl's metaphorical connotations. The goddess Wajet, often depicted with the head of a lioness, was a symbol of royal authority, simultaneously embodying both the stoic bravery of a lion and the perceptive intuition of the owl through her occasional avian associations. Therefore, the owl, as it silently glides through the transcendent barrier of the netherworld and earthly realm, serves as a spirit guide, ensuring the seamless journey of the pharaohs into the afterlife. Anchoring our explorative ship to the lands of Mesopotamia, we find the star of Ishtar gleaming brightly under the same vast desert sky. The symbol, the star of Ishtar or Nana, with its eight-pointed form, diverges in its religious and cultural symbolism from that of the Egyptian owl yet shares an invisible thread of conjoined metaphysical meanings. Ishtar, a goddess of love, beauty, war, and political power, was revered in the pantheon of the Sumerians and later, by her Semitic followers. Her symbols, particularly the owl, have woven a tapestry that mingles the themes of intuitive wisdom, power, and divine guidance. Here, the owl's eyes, glowing softly amidst the enveloping darkness, parallels the bright gleam of Venus, Ishtar's celestial counterpart, illuminating our path through the dark, expansive universe. The celestial embodiment of Ishtar is Venus, blazing brilliantly as the morning and evening star, reflects an earthly omnipresence connecting the divine feminine with intrinsic cyclical processes of creation, destruction, and rebirth. Owls, under Ishtar's symbolic umbrella, perch silently as watchers of earthly and celestial cycles, guardians of sacred knowledge and mystical wisdom that spiral through time and space. In the tapestry of these ancient civilizations, where owls lingered quietly yet potently amidst the narratives of gods and goddesses, we unravel threads of wisdom, protection, and spiritual guidance. To unearth these symbols is to illuminate our own journey, crafting a bridge that extends from the ancient, sandy soils of Egypt and Mesopotamia to our present moment. So, as we stand at the precipice of modernity, staring into the abyss of forgotten times, let the owl guide us, softly and wisely, through the veiled mysteries of the past. Engage with these symbols, not as distant relics, but as vibrant, living entities that pulsate through our collective consciousness imbuing our paths with the ancient wisdom that has perennially flickered, like a gently undulating flame, through the corridors of time. In the silent wisdom of the owl, intertwined with the divine feminine energy of Ishtar, find the encouragement to seek, explore, and reverence our past, as a luminescent guidepost to navigate the veiled complexities of our present and future journeys. Click like, subscribe, and share this channel.